Hi there, this is Ranjit and in this video, I'll show you how to generate battery health reports for your Windows computer. For example, uh, this is my Surface Pro 4 and as you can see, I generated this battery health report and using this, I can analyze my battery life how long it stays in standby and how much is the drain and it's very easy to do this if you are running windows 10 or windows 8 computer you don't have to install any third party utilities uh, this can be generated uh, by windows itself and i'll show you how we are using a windows 10 computer that is my surface pro 4 for this example which runs windows 10 professional and just go to the start menu and just right click here and from here you have to select this command prompt admin option just say yes to this option and here you have to just paste this command for example so as you can see this is the command so the actual command is this power uh, cfg slash battery report and i just want to output it on this uh, uh, c drive that's why i'm adding this for example and i just hit enter and it says that the battery life uh, report has been saved now you can just open your a windows file manager that's the explorer let's go to c prompt and as you can see it generated this file that is known as battery report and if you open this as you can see we can see this report and let me give you an idea it gives you your computer name and uh, here it also gives you an idea about the actual capacity of your battery and the current capacity as it's a very new computer the capacity is higher than the design capacity but again uh, if your computer is a bit old uh, this will be a little bit low so don't worry and it also gives you an idea about the uh, charging cycle count mine is currently at eight and the recent usage gives you uh, in depth uh, uh, what do you say state of your battery for the last three days you can just uh, look at it and get an idea about how much time it's stay, uh, staying in the battery and then if you put it on standby so this is a huge report that you get let's just scroll down and this gives you a graph to give you an idea about your battery life and uh, i also like this uh, report uh, if you uh, look at this one this actually gives you an idea how much battery is being consumed for example uh, look at this connected standby uh, as you can see it was on standby for one hour and it consumed one person battery life so this gives you an idea uh, if you feel uh, you're having a lot of high drain when you put your windows computer standby you can diagnose it via this for example uh, after the latest updates the standby drain for me has fallen down a lot on the surface pro 4 uh, for example as you can see look at this connected standby that means it, the machine was on standby and for eight hours when it was on standby it consumed just four percent battery life uh, on the surface pro 4 before the february update it was draining almost about four percent an hour but now it's close to about just uh, one percent for two hours so it's a huge improvement so this way you can analyze your battery drain and this also gives you an idea about the usage history and uh, as you can see uh, earlier to the update i got the update on 17th and uh, so sorry i applied it on 18th and as you can see the active time uh, earlier that i used to get and the connected standby was just about six hours but after the latest updates as you can see my connected uh, standby is really high about 13 to 16 hours so this way you can get an idea about your uh, battery life and this also the battery capacity history gives you an idea about the battery capacity and further down if you go this gives you a battery life estimate and this is also a very good way to get an idea about the battery life so if you have a windows based computer that has a battery like a laptop or a tablet you can easily use this battery report tool to get an idea about your battery life i hope you found this uh, video helpful thanks for watching this is ranjit and i hope to see you in my next video